Hello, hello, hello. There's no waiting, uh, waiting scream, uh, screen. Today we are starting right away in the game. Uh, so actually, I didn't really set up anything. So no waiting, uh, waiting scream. I cannot talk anymore. No waiting screen. Um, but I will uh, take it. I need a little break just to share some stuff on all the social medias and things like that. Uh, so let's copy the link. Um, actually, I'm just going to share it on Twitter. There we go. Why is it not the right thumbnail? I changed the thumbnail, you stupid thing. No. Not sharing that. Dang it. Why does it have to be stupid? And not properly made. Why? Okay, that's good enough. That's good enough. Hello, Thing Deep. Yes, you have missed my latest episode. I think I've started playing Create Mod um, with some friends. Uh, it's it's super fun. <laughs> it, it really, really is. Um, so let's. Uh, I, I got a few projects. In mind for tonight. I'm just gonna need one of those. The one with the corpses. Yeah, right. Yeah, you you did. You commented. Yeah, but yeah. Uh, so yeah, I'm uh, I'm playing modded tonight. I forgot to check if it was time to sleep. It is. Awesome, awesome. How are you doing, Thing Deep? How you doing, buddy? I hope you're doing good. Yeah, this is gonna be my area on the Northern Lights server. Uh, it's all spoilers, but it's not gonna be spoilers. I didn't even start recording a second episode yet. Don't explode close to my stuff. Stupid shiny creepers. I hate them. I hate you. There we go. Crisis averted. Um, so yeah, we are playing around with the trains. Right here is the entrance to... Did I see something bad there? Or was it just a fern? It was just a fern. Um, oh, took a whole week of vacation. That's amazing. That is amazing. I'm uh, starting my last week before the holidays, and I cannot. Uh, I can't. Can't wait for the holidays. It's gonna be great. Uh, but yeah, that was the entrance to the uh, the mini game that I built in my first episode. We're playing around with the trains. Sadly, they make my game crash. If I'm alone on the server somehow, but I'm still, uh, I'm still gonna work with those. They, they they are really seriously cool. I just can't show them because yeah, they, they're all turned off so that I can play. Um, 
Mini turned them off before they, uh, him and Cali went on vacation earlier this, uh, well, last weekend, I think. I'm not sure how far along they're going to be gone. Um, but yeah, so that's my, um, that's where the train's going to be coming from. There's going to be a bridge. It's, it's not done yet. It's going to be better, I promise. Um, so yeah, there's going to be the bridge. It's going to go down there. Go around here. Uh, um, it's not clear what's exactly the problem. I've been struggling with uh, create mod stuff. Like I won't do any demonstration, but if I hit something with create, like if I were to break that pipe with my pickaxe, I would crash. And since it's it's modded, it it takes a while to. Uh, it takes a while to uh, to restart, um, but yeah. So I've been struggling with uh, some stuff with create, but if we shut down the train, I can play and like we'll do some some group stuff. So they're they're gonna be able to have the train while I'm here. Probably the, it seems to be my my guess is that it crashes the game if. The train comes into a loaded chunk, and I'm like the only one there, or something like that. Because it wouldn't crash when I was on the server with Mini, uh, but as soon as he uh, logged out, I kept crashing. And it's never like a very regular, uh, like it, it, or it's not like every time I log on, I crash. It's just like after a minute or two. I will crash but like there, there's no real consistency except it's under like five minutes or something so it's probably because of the the path that it was taking so when it came into view or came into my uh my render distance it would crash what am i trying to do here falling that's what i'm trying to do also is uh, the music too loud should i lower the volume Okay, you can hear me easily, that's perfect. Go away, raccoon. Um, so yeah, that's the big train, the like main lines. So it's gonna go that way on this one and go that way back on this one. And it's gonna branch off to go to my place and then when it comes back, reconnects here and there's also this one line because there's going to be two trains on the track there's going to be the the carrier train but also a um, lava train uh, with uh, well that that brings lava to use as fuel so mini has one of those already so i'm gonna get connected to his track and that way I can have some lava, so it's gonna go down here. Lava's gonna get collect uh, co yeah, collected by this pipe here and get put in a big, big vat. Or not a vat, but a, uh, what do you call that? A tank, yes, big tank. Uh, so that's kind of what I wanted to work on. There's, well, two things that I want to work on. Taking care of. Like, when the, the lava train comes, like, uh, bringing the, uh, all the lava to the right tank. M probably moving the tank that I already have. It's uh, down there, I think. I've, I was down there earlier when I started the stream. Though I hate raccoons. I don't hate raccoons as much as I hate seagulls. Seagulls are the absolute worst. I hate them so much went exploring early game and I was like super happy I had like a stack of steak or well not, not a stack but like half a stack maybe of steak and we ran into a flock of seagulls and they just stole all of my food and I was starving and I, I got attacked by some other vicious animal 
and I, I couldn't reach in because I didn't have food. The stupid seagulls stole all of my food. <laughs> but yeah. Like, yeah, yeah. One of the projects would be to well, move my tank. Because at first it was... Hey, you're supposed to actually have a hose. Thank you. Um, at first, yeah, this hose was draining a... Um, a... Uh, a lava lake or a lava pond, which I thought was big enough to count as infinite, but it turns out it was not. Uh, so it's uh, I'm, I'm gonna run out of lava. So actually, actually, I'm gonna I'm not gonna keep the the big tank here. I'm gonna move it a bit further that way to be closer to where there's the uh, gonna be the tr the, the drop off station. Uh, do they steal from my inventory? I'm not gonna change my habits. They are annoying. <laughs> That's all. Um, but yeah. Moving the, the... What was that? Moving the thing closer to here. Like maybe under there. I'm not sure exactly what I'm going to do with that place here exactly. Uh, but uh, yeah. It's going to be where uh, I get my, uh, my lava. I'm definitely all over the place. I didn't finish explaining all the tracks. But yeah. When it goes down there, that's the lava, and up here it's gonna be the carriage train, the, the train that we take to go to other places. So that's where it's gonna stop. We can uh, get off the train and uh, whatever, whatever, go around the place. Probably gonna yeah, make something up here, kind of a welcoming area or something like that. And then it's gonna go into this little tunnel here. It goes up didn't need to go up, it's gonna go down right after that, but uh, yeah, then it uh, it goes down here, so it goes out of the tunnel, goes down there, it's super cool. Everything you know about this mod pack is from me, oh, that that, that really means that you don't know much, because I, I really don't know much, but uh, yeah, seagulls, seagulls man, they're annoying, so annoying. I think they steal from you if you have uh, if you have food on your hotbar. So I think if you keep the food on your uh, like in your inventory in your backpack or something like that, you'll be fine. So Forty-seven is the right height. I'm gonna pick that lapis. You never know when you're gonna need lapis. Um, if I'm here, there we go. I can see that little path. You have to keep food on your hot bar. Well, yeah, because you you need to have the food in your hot bar to to eat it. So unless like you pick a steak like w one at a time and you eat it you, you eat them one at a time unless you do it like that which could work but yeah it's uh, not the most fun So, I think I'm just gonna keep my uh, tank here. That's a good place. It could be right here. I put it here. Um, so I'm gonna start placing it like that. There we go gonna dig out all around it oh gonna take that copper so yeah you're saying you haven't really seen much on uh, about create mod 
it's it's a seriously fun mod. Like for anyone who's like technical, but not just like about extreme efficiency and stuff like that, but like more about uh, cinematic or maybe not cinematic, but like kinetic redstone redstone contraptions that look cool. It's a, it's a very, very, very fun mod. Now I'm not sure why I'm picking all that coal. We don't really need it all that much. What I need is some stone to fill the whole thing. Just to have a better looking floor, because you do need a lot of endesite in this mod. Uh, did I have more in this site? Not that good. Oops, okay. Here. I'm gonna take care of that. Yeah, honestly, I I never really cared about modded until like I joined this server, and it's it's seriously it's fun. Uh, I wouldn't really play most mods like uh, like those big mod packs and stuff like that. That I still don't really care. Um, but like create is is absolutely cool. And uh, the other one that we have, the the other main one that we have is uh, better Minecraft. So that's. Um, it kind of sort of feels like a, a huge version of what I was doing with my uh, my suggestions series. Like just, well, uh, in my series it was mostly about small changes to the game to what was already existing, but they, they do address a lot of those things, like make things uh, just make more sense and a bit more fun and all that stuff. But if I put the pipes... Ah, uh, that's great. They already connect like that. So yeah, basically how it works. I think you figured that out already, but yeah, you have tanks like that where you can put all sorts of fluids uh, you can put like honey and stuff, but the, the most important ones are like lava and well, maybe water, but it, it's not better than an infinite water source, I guess. Um, so, what if. Yeah, I'm gonna grab that. Uh yeah. I'm gonna get a couple of wheels. Oh yeah, I can I'm gonna be able to change the speed if I put it like that. Uh no, that's bad. Where's my wrench? Who took my wrench? How did I lose my wrench? Why is it here? Why did I do that? Actually, I'm just gonna use some shafts. And that. Remove this. And like, look at that. Just the way to place things. From here I can choose like where do I want to place that uh, that cogwheel like just from here I can place it on top there and then same thing with that shaft or it's it good or th I think it's just when it's attached to another shaft yeah see there I'm aiming at this shaft here and it's adding them all the way on the right there I can extend it that way. Super cool. Super cool mechanic. It it it's not really 
all that Minecrafty, but it's it's great that it works like that. And now you need to attach this this belt here. And if I do that, wrong way. There we go. And let's put a little window just to see. See, look at that. There's some lava going into the other tank. Um, hold W to ponder. Yep. Yeah. Uh, another very, very cool mechanic. So if I hold W. Hopefully this one doesn't crash. Nope. I think it was gonna... Uh, basically, it kind of opens a tutorial. Again, it's one of the things that crashes sometimes for me. And the way I see if it's gonna crash, it's usually when there's this little uh, flashes of white. Um, but yeah, it's a, it's a super cool, super cool mechanic. Also, is there also it's not there yet let's put some windows along the way or is it just not strong enough uh, no bad pipe okay oh so it doesn't reach oh i didn't know that yeah that makes sense um, actually, I'm gonna start it. What if I give it more power? So there's another thing. Super cool. You can do some uh, automation stuff. It's it's really fun. So th this here, it's a big tank like this one. But I have some uh, steam engines on top. And some heaters underneath. So if I give these heaters some lava... They basically act like a kind of like a furnace, so they're uh, blaze burners. And yeah, if you give them a uh, any any sort of fuel, they're gonna start creating heat. And so now it's heating the uh, the boiler, so it's making these motors faster and, and stronger. Oops, I was standing on that, and now it's making that little robot arm like. A lot faster and like when the bucket is well now it's full of lava so it just drops it back on the conveyor belt but when it grabs it and if one of the uh, the heaters is empty it's gonna give it the lava drop the empty bucket here the container full of molten rock wasn't hot uh, that's just a uh, that's just an empty empty uh, tank it wasn't full of, uh, of lava but yeah, it's gonna drop the empty bucket here. Bucket's gonna stop there. The uh, spout is gonna fill it, and it's gonna grab it back there. Give it to another one, and when it's th there's no empty spot, there's nowhere to put the lava. It just puts it back there, and it does nothing. I could actually close it, uh, and I was doing all of that just to see if I could. Nope. That did not work, so I'm gonna need more of those. More of those. Oh, just make them. Oh, no, 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 that's bad. That's bad. No, bad lava. Um, how am I gonna take care of that? I'm just gonna have a shaft on top. That should be fine. Like that. Um... I could pick that box. Is it rotating the right way? Yes, it is. Perfect. So now it's gonna reach all the way out here. 
No, it won't. I'm gonna put my second pump. Like guess so. Now, oh. and we have lava. Yay! It works. It works. That's great. That is great. Um, so slowly but surely, we're gonna transfer the lava from this container here to this other one over there so when like one layer is going to be empty i can remove it actually no i can make more i don't have to be so stingy with my stuff we got loads of uh, of those um going to grab some more blossom wood Can I make... No, I can't. Um, cannot make some uh, barrels. Uh, so I'm gonna need nine. Wait. All of that goes into planks. Uh, barrels. some more fluid tanks. Oh, it's already full. That's good to know that it's working quite fast. So now I think if I were to remove those, yeah, I don't think I lost anything. Wait a second. Why is nothing going through anymore? What? What's wrong? What's wrong? Oops. So did that change something? Did I have to fill it from the what happened? Why? Why? Seems to be moving. Like that's not connected to anything. Why would it 
have any form of impact on that. Hello, Randall. How are you doing? How are you doing? Welcome to the stream. We're trying to understand why stuff doesn't work. Ah, it works. There you go. There we go. Separate pump to make the lava go up. No, I think it was just. Ah, uh, maybe since I changed, because I didn't really check in the. No, the windows were full. Were they? Too many things going on here. Honestly, if you understand redstone, you can understand that. It's um. Yeah, I, I, I had made the connection, by the way. <laughs> uh, but yeah, if you can understand redstone, you're gonna understand that. It's it's the same same logic. Yeah, well, same uh, yeah lo logical principles. It's not the same uh, concepts that are used, but uh, logic applies in the same way. Um, but yeah. Instead of just uh, some kind of weird electric power, it's uh, rotational power, basically. Uh, but yeah, no, you don't need like a one specific pump to go up. Actually, even like it could have stayed at the bottom level, I think. Yeah. Yeah, definitely, you have to play with it to... Uh, actually understand it. Sorry, I just I jammed my finger in my eye and I cut some onions earlier, so it's super itchy now. You know when your your eye is itchy and you do something that makes it just worst. So much fun. So much fun. Um Yeah, so we got that going. I'm guessing now if I remove this, yeah, it's gonna freeze it again. Ah, it started again. That's good. That is good. I, I washed my hands after cutting the onions. It's just... Either I'm bad at washing my hands, or, you know... I, uh... No, I'm probably just bad at washing my hands. Um... Barn Dog, how did you play back in the days? Did, did he make you play Create 2? Or... Or was it, like, other other mods um, so the other thing that I wanted to do was to have kind of a lift to bring me down to this level because I'm I'm playing in create mod, you know, a, a mod full of automation and cool looking things and all of that. And I'm still climbing a ladder. That's that's bad. That makes no sense. Um so 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 um well I already had a lift here, but I had to remove it because of the train tracks that I put here. Um, so I'm thinking of either putting it here, like it would 
like reach the surface. Or yeah, actually, you know what? I'm gonna put it here. But it's gonna be in the middle, and it's gonna be super scary. Yeah. Like it's gonna be empty all around it. Just gonna have like a three by three here going up and down. Yeah, up and down. A Dwemer City? I don't know what that means. Oh, and it's right in the middle of that little path that I had made. That's very, very convenient. it would be a bit lower down but it's pretty close to well not the surface but at least that part here um so I'm gonna put it at that height instead Hey, how you doing, Randall? Haven't talked to you in a little while. What's uh, what's up? What's happening? Oh, and and thing deep, I you you uh, mentioned. That you had taken a vacation? Did you go somewhere or did you just stay home, stay in and recharge the batteries? Like what I'm gonna do with my vacation? Stayed home for nine days straight. That's great. That's probably what I'm gonna aim to do. Saturday through the next Sunday. <laughs> that's the dream. That's the dream. Oh, that's completely empty. That's great. That is just great. Fantastic. Um... So now, I'm not gonna change too much about that thing here, because I'm... I could remove it all, but nah, 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 I'm not gonna remove it yet. I'm gonna keep it for a little while still. I'm just gonna connect this down here. Uh, no, that's that fight's gonna be annoying. Who moved my wrench? Uh, I got my gearbox. Going over to your uh, your parents. Do you spend a lot of time over there, or? Over there, but uh, out there. Is it? It's night time. Eh? No, it's not night time. It's noon. And that looks weird. So I'm gonna move this. Nope. There we go. 
that looks better. Oh, six to seven hours away, yeah. Yes, you won't just go for the for the weekend. Oh, that's cool. Cool that they have time to come over. I was talking to one of my coworkers who's kind of in this pretty similar situation, like with her parents. They, she she moved out of her her hometown, and it's a uh, something like that. Maybe, maybe not six or seven hours away, but like uh, five five hours away, six hours away, maybe. You got you have F to M. You mean Friday to m and Monday off? Is that what you mean? Okay, for the weekend. Oh, that's cool. You still work during the holidays, though? I didn't know that. Okay, I'm pretty sure that song is too loud. It's a good song. Don't get me wrong. But. But. Pretty sure it's too loud. Uh, what was I gonna do? Yeah, the lift. Um, so, I have a... Pulley. I'm gonna need my glue. So the first lift that I made was made with the gantry. But where's my rope pulley? There it is. Um, and I'm gonna make two more. How do you make them? Rope pulley. Heat and the side casing wool. Ah, uh, okay, yeah. Yeah, that makes... That makes sense. In that case, yeah. Um... So the floor is gonna be made out of... What could I use for the floor? What would be a good block? Probably some kind of wood, but which one? Maybe maple? Yeah. Yeah, that's good. You'll have drastically fewer kids that week. Yeah, yeah, that that does make a lot of sense. Green was a little behind. No worries about that. Things are going well. That's great. That's good to hear. Very, very good to hear. Things are going well. Um... Now, how is that gonna look? I make it just five by five because now we have, yeah, I want to have four ropes, like one on each corner. So if, if it's just three by three, it's gonna look a bit weird. I need nine. 
steak and baked beans. That's cool. That is cool. Don't know if you would have enjoyed my dinner with uh, rice and tofu. With uh, other veggies, had to make a lot for my uh, my lunches this week. So the thing I'm wondering is. I'm putting them like that. Uh, yeah. It feels great when you when you know how you like it and what to do with it. It's uh, it's actually really great. But many people don't don't like it. Yeah. But wait, maybe I do I only have one. Um Yeah, I um had a Christmas dinner yesterday night and uh well i i don't eat meat so my my mother's been uh very accommodating uh with that and uh a few of my cousins don't eat meat anymore either so like she had uh, a bunch of uh vegetarian options for uh for the the dinner it was really fun to uh like watch my uh, my older uncles and, and aunts try it, try that that kind of food it was not really in their their uh, eating habits, so it was uh, it was funny seeing that. Oh, that's too much. Right. Dang it, dang it. Uh, should I just put a big water wheel behind? Or should I get that up from there? Uh, what should I do? Um, no, I'm just gonna put a few water wheels. It's gonna be a bit easier to do. Uh, so I got one here. Let's say three. Wait, what kind of stress? I can start like looking at things. Yes, yeah, so, like it, it. It was fun seeing, uh, seeing my older uncles trying uh, meat-free food. <laughs> it was a. Uh, a funny sight. Uh, so two fifty six, and how much does this one have? Okay, so it's. M I never really checked how. It won't work. The other way around either yeah i've never really checked the uh the different levels of uh, of stress and how all of that works i'm not sure how much stress this thing is gonna need 
Um, <laughs> yeah. There are many members of my family who would also uh Yeah. Yeah, so some people are really just set in their habits and Others are really interested in trying anything. Funny thing is, I'm usually the one who's really set in his habits. But, yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna remove all that. Um, I forgot to make the water wheel. Hello, Dev. How you doing? How you doing, buddy? Oh, can get them here. Wait, I need. Welcome to the stream, Dev. Doing better now. You were doing bad earlier. I mean, we talked earlier today, right? Am I? I think I'm being confused now. I'm all... I don't know what's happening anymore. <laughs> the French Canadian lover. Where are you going with that? <laughs> Okay, you're better because uh, I'm streaming. Oh, you. Trying to make me blush or something. get what's happening. <laughs> um. Stupid water wheel. That's the one thing I never figured out is how to put it in the right direction. Is it the right way around? Yeah, seems to be. Okay. Maybe it was the right way around all along. And I'm just too clueless to uh, have noticed. Yes, it's going the wrong way. I, I know. I saw. Uh, just gonna put a thingy. I think it's the, that. And some redstone and a cog wheel. No, not a gearbox. A gear shift. Yep. Yeah. So I can power it with a lever. Why do I not have a lever? Who didn't bring the lever here? Wait, where am 
my sticks. Ah, uh, there they are. We'll probably make a lever with that. Perfect. I'm really, really enjoying Create Mod. Seriously, it's it's amazing. The one thing that I don't enjoy about it is that uh, my computer has a hard time running it. I I think um, like there are a few issues that I've uh, there's a lever above my head. I don't get what you're saying. Anyway, yeah, there. I, I didn't want to steal a lever from somewhere else. Uh, but as I was saying, yeah, um, there's uh, one thing that uh, like I'm struggling with. Like it, the game will crash sometimes when um, when uh, I'm I'm breaking some create mod stuff with uh, well not with the wrench. So if I were to try and break that shaft with a pickaxe it would crash the game or even if someone's breaking it like it will break the game um so that's super annoying now i'm picking up these four blocks that is great but what i want to try out is first of all let's go to bed um, yeah, there was a lever. This one, right here. And this one there. Uh, but I, I didn't want to use them. Um, and the, the other more major issue that uh, I have, and that, that's really super annoying, is that there are trains in this uh, version of the mod. And uh, I'm also really struggling with the trains. Uh, they crash my game, it's, mm, well, yeah, no, it, it, it's the trains because uh, they've been deactivated and now I don't crash anymore, but uh, at some point it would just crash my game, like, within a minute of being on the server. My guess was they, the game crashed when the train entered some uh, some loaded chunks from some previously unloaded chunks. Yeah, there's uh, there's trains. Well, there's train tracks here. We uh, I got this little bridge that I'm gonna make uh, a lot prettier eventually. Uh, but it's gonna go down here. I have the track here. It's gonna split here. There's gonna be my la my uh, lava delivery train going down here and going back that way. And. There's going to be the, the, the passenger train going here. It's going to stop here at the station. And then it's going to go around. Uh, can I give Minecraft more RAM? Um, can I? The answer would be no. Could I? Probably. If I knew what I was doing. Um... Uh, that could be something to, uh, to look out, to, or to, to, to check out. Uh, I, I do not know how to do any of those things, sadly. Just need to download it. Um, so yeah, that's the train that we have. So right now it's, like, it's not being loaded as a train. It's, um, just... Like, it, it's not activated or anything, so it can't start. We have a chicken conductor. Uh, the, the driver of the train is a chicken. It has an adorable little hat when the train is active. Uh, but, sadly, it's not active right now. I'll, I'll definitely stream when uh, Minnie and Kelly comes... Uh, the, when they come back. Uh, yeah, when they come back, yeah, we'll, we'll try and fix everything. And, uh, yeah, you'll get to see the the train driver chicken. Like, Back to the Future Volume 3. Yeah, yeah, it really has that feel. That, that mod really has 
that feel. It, it, it's a really cool looking train. <laughs> Chicken engineer. Uh, possibly? I don't know. I, I'm starting to think that the word conductor is like for orchestras or something. <laughs> and not for trains. But, uh, I don't know. I, uh, I'm not totally sure. <laughs> But yeah, so that's uh, that's our train. So when it all works, it's gonna move around the server on the set schedule and all of that. It's gonna go between between bases. So yeah, it's gonna be super cool. Measures the people on the train. Huh, that's interesting. Engineer drives. Ah. That's f that's funny because, like to me, conductor, like would translate directly to driver. And also, yeah, uh, five by five is good enough for that. So if I put it like that. Doesn't seem to cause any issue, that's good to know. I'm gonna remove that snow. Because I was starting to think. Let's just see if I slime all of that. Then I could also slime. All of that and that would it also work oops sorry about that all right see you Randall have a good rest of your day conductor of an orchestra manages the people <laughs> yeah that's a good one that's a good one. Yeah, you got me there. With your thoughts and ideas. Uh, now, big problem. Big major issues. Oh, wait, are they not? Are they connected together? Only one way to find out. And it's two. Move it down. Just not sure how I'm gonna do that. Um. A Did you mean a four hour stream in about conductors? Because it's not gonna happen. It's it's that's not what's gonna happen tonight uh, sorry to disappoint you okay so it looks weird um i'm gonna try and break can i break that without Breaking anything. Okay. Uh, where's my lever? Who stole my... Who took my lever? Is it... Ah. Did it fall on the conveyor belt? I mean, I'm not crazy right now, right? There is no lever 
anywhere to be seen. Right? The semiconductor can the control half electricity. No, that's not how it works. There it is. I knew it. Right to run away from me. There we go. Okay, so. I like the look of having the four ropes on each corner. Some things in this mud just drop directly in your inventory when you break them, but not all. Uh, the things that go into my inventory is uh, all of the uh, the stuff that is in Create Mod that I break with the wrench. Like the the wrench is a, a Create Mod thing only, so like I I probably couldn't break that lever. No. I can break it. Well, well, well. That's interesting. Uh. Good to know. Good to know. I was not aware of that. Thank you for uh, pointing it out. Think deep. It really helps. <laughs> It really helped. I mean, uh, so the the issue that I have right now is that I've glued the entire platform to uh, like this rope here, so that they are all disconnected. Like, oh, not all four ropes, because I'm thinking there could be, like, a conflict or something. But now that I think of it, like, it seemed to work the first time, so I'm gonna try it like that again, just to see. Like, it kind of seemed like some of the ropes... It kind of seemed like, yes, yeah, some of the ropes... We're just lowering and not touching anything, so that I think it's just... Oh, that's a problem? Where'd the blocks go? Yeah, that's gonna be a problem. Uh. Uh. can finally see your phone made you watch in in uh, 144 wow very retro very very retro Why doesn't it go all the way to the surface? Because it's not the actual elevator, it was just me testing testing out some stuff. Um, which is a very, very good question. Why didn't I make it? Well, it. I, I should have said it earlier, but yeah, it, it was more about testing out some stuff. 
so they... Of course I'm not wearing pants. Of course I'm not. Uh, yeah, so basically what happened was... Since they were all connected together, I think it's this one here. This one was... Uh, was the, the one that was pulling and or pushing them. Or, or the, the, the entire platform. Uh, so yeah, it was pushing it down. Sorry about that. Got the sniffles. Um, and the other ones were just going down... Uh, but I guess when the platform reached that layer here, that's when it became solid. But the uh, the ropes kept going down because they like had started going down through them when they were not solid. So they broke them like when they reached the the. The bottom of, of where they were going. Th there's some weird stuff like that that uh, happens in the in the game or in in the mud. Uh, it's it's some mechanics that people use sometimes for uh, for some contraptions. Uh, I know that uh, Mini, who's been playing a, a lot with the the create part of the server. Uh, he made a cobblestone farm using that kind of principle of something that moves into blocks when they're not yet solid, and when they become solid, they break the blocks that they're in conflict with, the blocks that they're uh, in the same place as. Uh, so, what we could do would be to have... Something like that. It's gonna make the platform look a tiny bit wonky. But that's not that big of a deal. So like right now, this entire part is connected to this one. This one holds all of that. This one holds only that block. And this one holds all of that. Also, I think I figured out how I'm actually going to fix things. I'm just going to put one more block on top. Yeah, okay. You like that last one? I'm not sure what. Uh, yeah, that, that's a good configuration. But... We, we, we got a plan. We got a plan. Uh, so now I can... Remove all of that. Oh, the... The song? Were you talking about the song that you liked, or...? Yeah, glad it works. Oh, when it pushed down the four corners, you like that configuration? Yeah, it was not, not the best, not ideal. didn't really accomplish what I wanted it to accomplish. 
but yeah, I, I figured out a way to make it work. Uh, how about better Minecraft? It's cool too. Uh, it's n a bit less what I'm interested in, but it's still fun. Um, the, the cool thing about big mod, mod packs like that is there's always stuff you can ignore. Uh, but there's there doesn't seem to be uh, like some big... Uh, uh, like... I'm gonna get you some cool new gears that's just better tier. It, it's not something that really interests me. Like, I, I rarely ever use netherite tools and, and armor. So, yeah. So there's that, but I, uh, I don't really have to use any of that. But yeah, that's always good. Um, but other than that, yeah, it's it's cool, like, cool new mobs, there's not all the mobs, or, like, all the animals that should be there are in there. There are some mobs that are simply despicable. Uh, but some, uh, and, and the, the best possible animals, um aren't in the game sadly uh, the person made some uh, person who made these uh, these animals made some uh, strange choices but you know you know uh, I'd, I'd much rather not talk about that now it's still painful uh, holy crap my inventory is full let's just go empty that I don't need to have that much stuff uh, I could start this to fill this container. Like, I don't need that much stone. Uh, and if I can go there. And yeah, I, I love the new mobs. Stupid creepers. But yeah, they made the weird choice to put in seals, but no walruses. It's as if they were doing it on purpose just to make me angry. But it, there might be another reason. I don't know. I'm not in their head. I don't know what they were thinking. Much rather not know. And uh, yeah, that's uh, all there's gonna be. <laughs> that would be an absolute nightmare. It turns them into zombies that then turn into more chrysalids. <laughs> How does Eurotokarak not know the word villager? Tusks are hard to coat, right? Well, there are elephants, though. I actually have an elephant. It's, it's mine. I tamed it. It's amazing. Not sure where it is. But yeah, I have my very own elephant. I also have a dog. I uh, forgot what breed it is, but like they have... Is it a Shiba? Shiba Inu? Something like that? Yeah, I got one of those. Also, it's been sitting in the snow. For many, many years. Yeah, it's a Shiba. That's my dog. Uh, 
Uh, but my elephant is over there. There's my elephant. But it definitely looks like I currently am riding an elephant. So I don't know what you're thinking about right now, but... That's me on my elephant. Are you jealous? I'm gonna try not bring the elephant in the uh, in the water. Also, not being in F5 mode is really gonna help. Um, you know. Yep. So that's my elephant, my new best friend. Oh yay, there's a creeper in the way. And some lovers. Yay! So let's just head back home and sleep. <laughs> Again with that good old joke, Dev. It's because they're uh it's cause I'm bad at finding elephants, is that it? Cause I'm I'm very, very bad at finding elephants. How do you eat an elephant? Uh, I don't know. Do you ask politely? That's how I would. Yeah, a, a bite at a time. Yeah, but sometimes when you're trying to find something, it kind of ends up being in your your blind spot, and you can't see it for some weird reason. I'm just trying to give more heat to. Uh, my uh my boiler just so it goes a bit faster the pump should be good enough okay yeah that's that's good how to get an elephant in the refrigerator you empty the refrigerator oh right now you open the door put the elephant yeah I mean, you should have known that, Dev. I'm I'm guessing you're kind of playing along now, but wasn't it you who kept telling that joke all the time? <laughs> like wasn't that your favorite joke at some point? Or am I being mistaken again? Um, geez, no, I'm, I'm just gonna, sorry, I'm, I'm really not, not being focused on what I should be doing. Uh, I'm just gonna work on the frame just to put the, um, the elevator, the, uh, four rope pulleys. Um, 
wait, that was the worst way to do that. Let's just go like that. Uh, so, if I want the floor to be at that height... Uh, and I need to put the pulleys here. Right. So the platform is going to be here and the little fence thingy is going to be above that. if you can rotate them okay yeah that makes sense um What can a train only think about one thing at a time? Yeah, something about a one-track mind. That would make sense. <laughs> a tired train. Oh, I'm gonna need... Uh, tire train, I'm not sure. It's a locomotive. <laughs> what? <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, that, that would be a bus. Get it? Because, yeah. Because of the, the thing that... Thing Deep said. Exactly. Dang it! How did I fall again? No comments, please. No comments. Gravity is very, very helpful. Sometimes. There we go. Wait, is that... Off-centered? Wait, 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 wait. How did I do that? How? Why? How? What? How did that happen? Dang it. <laughs> Stick beats. That's a good one. Hey, 
at least I got these two blocks of stone back. That's what's important. Why don't I just use blocks to get to where I want to be? Frenchman wearing sandals. Oh, that's good. Wait, what? Unicorns and dragon. What? Okay. Oh, I uh, didn't see Thing Deeps. I thought it, it was yeah, Unicorns and Dragons was the name of the Frenchman wearing sandals. And I it, it, I couldn't understand. Uh, the lion being the king of beasts, called all the animals together to a meeting. Everyone showed up except for two. Which ones... The elephant and the walrus are still messing around with the refrigerator. Of course, of course, they are. Okay. Now they're centered, and they're not centered here. I can't believe placing four blocks can take so many attempts. Also, should I just try to correct all of that? Or should I go sleep and make sure I don't get creepered by one of those two creepers behind me? Ah, that's good. I made it. Perfect. First try. Now I can go sleep. Which days are the strongest? Uh, that's a good one. Weekdays. Uh, yeah, falling snow layers actually land intact. And they can also land on, uh, well, snow can accumulate on uh, stairs and slabs can also make more than a single layer but yeah like if I break this the snow will fall underneath <laughs> you can see some of those here in here snowy, uh, snowy stairs the thing that's super annoying is that like you can't just break them with the right tool somehow and you can't like shovel the snow from the stair you have to break the block or at least I haven't figured out how to uh, how to actually 
uh, break them or remove the, the snow, except for that water bucket method. Which is one more reason to always carry a water bucket in your inventory. Uh, what's the difference between a well-dressed man on a unicycle and a poorly dressed man on a bicycle? Wait, did I pronounce them right? Unicycle and bicycle? It's not unicycle, but it's bicycle. That's weird. Putting a block above the stair. Breaking the snow. That's... You know what? That, that would make so much sense. Let's try it out. Nope. That does not work. Somehow. <laughs> nope. It. I thought her. Uh, yeah. A tire. Does it say uh, unicycle and a bicycle? So it's. One or two tires. So the, the difference is a tire. YouTube didn't like that joke. Yeah. Yeah, it defaults to top chat, and I don't understand why that's so annoying. Oh, you don't see that? I thought you meant like you didn't understand the joke itself. But you didn't see, like, when Dev asked it. Um. Alright, well, it's past 10.30. I thought I would stream till about 10 and yeah a bit past my bedtime and I got a stupid boring job meeting and I haven't been to one of those job meetings in like a year or something no I think I was at one of those at the end of the school year last year so sometime in like May or June or some something, something like that and I haven't been to one of those since. So yeah, I um, got the message that it would be required that I uh, join them for, for that meeting. I'd need to endure it with my fellow co-workers. So yeah, I have to... Uh, get up early sadly so yeah i'm gonna have to end the stream now so thank you so much for joining me i i, I hope you enjoyed i really did enjoy myself uh with the uh, uh the crocodiles are at the meeting with the lion so you can just swim oh <laughs> that's a good one a good call back to the uh, earlier joke alright well thank you so much bye see ya how do I end that there we go bye